guys, it's Lim again. So today's video is my August favorites and I refuse to believe that August is almost over. It's almost September. The summer is ended and I return back to school very soon. It feels like yesterday I just recorded like my June or July favorites and now I'm recording my August favorites and saying that the summer is pretty much over. Like that is crazy. I just want summer to last forever. I am a little bit excited for the fall, but I'm only excited for like fall fashion and like the fall beauty trends and like going shopping for some new fall clothes. But other than that, I'm not really excited to return back to school and say goodbye to summer. But anyway, in this video, I have a lot of like beauty and fashion and random things that I was loving throughout the month of August and can't wait to show you guys. So let me get started. So my first favorite is a foundation brush and this is by the brand Real Techniques and this is their stippling brush and I got this at a drugstore and I remember having a coupon like 20% off one item so I decided to pick this up because this was kind of expensive I think it was like $10 so I got it on sale and that's why I bought it but I just love this brush and the foundation that I've been using I mentioned in my July favorites is the Revlon Color Stay Whip Foundation and I feel like that works the best when you apply it with a brush and this is the brush that I've been using I like how it's a stippling brush so it's really like nice and durable which makes it easy to blend your foundation so I have been using this a lot I used it today that's why it's kind of dirty so now I'm moving on to some eye products because in every favorite video of mine I always have like so many like eyeshadows that I've been loving so my first eye product is this benefit creaseless cream eyeshadow slash liner and I use these as a base and this is in the color birthday suit and I really like this color because I don't have anything like this in like my cream cream shadow collection because it's like a nice like taupey brown color but it's super like wearable and neutral you can layer this under like brown or like champagne colored eyeshadows or you can wear it alone and sometimes I wear it alone because it's such a beautiful color I like to describe this color as a light taupe color because it's not like a champagne -y color like Max Bear Study or it's not like a bronze color like the Maybelline color tattoo and bad to the bronze it's just a nice unique taupey color and these benefit cream shadows stay on forever so my next eye product that I have been loving is a eyeshadow quad and this is what I used in my um, back to school high school makeup tutorial and I love using this Maybelline Eye Studio Quad and this is in the color Copper Chic and I just love the colors in this quad. They're all like copper bronze colors which are like my all time favorite eyeshadow colors and you can create such a nice like neutral wearable look and this is just perfect for school that's why I featured it in my high school makeup tutorial and the pigmentation of these eyeshadows are incredible and if you haven't seen my high school makeup tutorial featuring this product check that out I'll link it somewhere over here maybe I'll link it over here or here or here or here or on my face I don't know but if you see some annotation that is the link to my high school makeup tutorial featuring this beautiful Maybelline Eye Studio Quad. My next August favorite is my MAC Neutral Palette. And I have just been experimenting a lot with my MAC eyeshadows because I feel like I left them out, like I haven't been using them. So for the month of August, I really wanted to use all of my neutral eyeshadows. I custom made this. Um, I've been collecting like MAC eyeshadows for a long time now and I completed this palette and this is like my neutral palette and I hope to do like an updated video showing you guys all of my MAC eyeshadow. If you think that is a good idea, let me know. The colors that I've been using a lot are All That Glitters right here, I actually hit pan on it, Naked Lunch, Rice Paper, um, Satin Taupe, then I have been using the color Sable which is like a really pretty like red brown, perfect for the crease. So i just been loving my MAC Neutral Eye Palette. So now moving on to eyeliners because I always have like eyeliners I like to talk about. And the first one is this Maybelline Master Precise um, Liquid Eyeliner. And this is a great liquid eyeliner. I love the felt tip. It's super long which makes it so easy to use. You can trace either a thin or thick um, line on your top lash line. And then this is great for creating like a cat eye because it's so long that you can use like the felt tip as your guide like all you have to do is just like press it and you'll have like a nice like line and then you can like you know touch it up I really like this definitely recommend it My favorite eyeliner is one of these NYX slide on glide on stay on and definitely a turn on waterproof extreme shine eyeliner best eyeliners ever they're like the dupes for the urban decay um 24 7 glide on eyeliners but these are so much cheaper they come in so many different colors this is in the color golden bronze and this is such a pretty 
golden bronze color like the name says I love to wear this on my waterline especially when I wear like brown or gold eyeshadows it's not too dark but it's definitely noticeable this color is more interesting than just a basic brown so I really like these eyeliners they are the best my next eyeliner is a MAC eyeliner and I got this in the beginning of the summer because this color is beautiful and this is the color undercurrent and this is such a pretty like green blue color with like hints of shimmer in it. It looks really dark but when you apply it it's really bright and summery and I just like applying this to my top lash line. This eyeliner color is so eye catching. I get so many compliments when I wear it because it's so unique and pretty. Next August favorite of mine is a recent purchase but I really really like this and it's the Maybelline Master Shape Precise Eyebrow Pencil and this is my first eyebrow pencil because I never really paid attention to my brows. I never really filled them in but I was like you know what maybe I should start because your eyebrows really do define like your face and I just wanted like an easy eyebrow pencil like something for beginners and I love this it's so easy to use and this is what it looks like that's what the um, pencil looks like but then on the other side it has this brush which is great because when you apply the pencil to your brows you use this brush and it blends it out so nicely creating such a natural look and then I set it with some um, clear mascara I got the color soft brown and I think this color matches perfect I actually filled in my brows right now I don't know if you can tell the difference if I'm like using the wrong color or if I'm like filling them in wrong but I really like it so now I have um, two hair favorites of mine and the first is this Neutrogena triple moisture silk touch leave-in cream with UV shield and this is just a leave-in conditioner and this helps restore damaged hair it protects your hair from the Sun or any like heat products it makes my hair feel very soft and healthy it doesn't make my hair greasy it's definitely a great leave-in conditioner because I know there are so many like leave-in conditioners um, out there but I definitely recommend this one next hair favorite is this suave volumizing mousse and I've been really liking like suave hair products I'm using a suave um, shampoo and conditioner I use a suave hairspray they really are like salon quality and they're so cheap and I really like this volumizing mousse I apply this to my damp hair before I blow dry it, it makes my hair easier to style it gives my hair some volume and it doesn't make my hair greasy or weigh it down so I really like this so now I have have two fashion favorites and they're actually like the same thing but in different colors and they are these American Apparel um, loose fitting tank tops they're short they're really big in the sleeve area great for the pool when you wear them over your bathing suit they do show a little bit of skin so that's why I think they're great for the pool because you are wearing a bathing suit so I have this really bright and fun yellow color which is my favorite and then I also have a hot pink color We're moving on to some random favorites because I decided to add some random favorites to this video even though this video is probably super long because now that I'm thinking of it I had a lot to talk about so I'll try to make my random favorites very short but I have two songs that I have been loving throughout the month of August and the first one is Nicki Minaj's new song Pound the Alarm I love Nicki Minaj. Her songs are just so upbeat and you can dance to them, you can sing to them, you can just like rock out to them and they put you in a good mood. And my second favorite song is Cher Lloyd's um, new single, um, I Want You Back. And I believe she's a singer from the UK and I love her songs. Like the lyrics are just so catchy, the beat is so catchy. And I really like her style both with music and her fashion and like makeup style. And I just really like her. I think she's a great artist. My last random favorite is a food favorite and it's like my all time favorite snack and it's goldfish and especially the pretzel flavor I like the cheddar flavor too but I love these goldfish pretzel flavors they are so addicting they're such a yummy snack I think I'm gonna have these with my lunch today because they are so so yummy they are the snack that smiles back goldfish I love goldfish. I think that is it for my August favorites. Sorry that I had so much to talk about. When I was about to film this video, I was like, oh, I don't really have that many favorites. But then I just realized, I'm like, oh my goodness, like I was loving a lot during the month of August. And like always, if you have any video requests, whether they be more back to school videos or now fall videos, please let me know in the comments below. Thank you guys so, so much for watching and I'll see you next video. Bye.